JP. I'm with Form Labs uh, from Massachusetts. We're a, a stereolithography 3D printer manufacturer. About two weeks ago, we launched a new material called Dental SG. Uh, the SG stands for Surgical Guide, um, and it's a Class 1 FDA certified uh, material that can be uh, temporarily inserted into the mouth for uh, the purposes of implant dentistry. So if you ever had a crown or a root canal, uh, the dentist is oftentimes just kind of guessing uh, where to drill. Uh, and this allows them to take a 3D scan using an intraoral scanner, which is a device that most modern dentists will actually already have in the office. Um, and they can make a 3D model uh, of your teeth, of your uh, jawline, and then they can print that, and they can print a guide that goes on top of the uh, mold so they can actually practice the surgery before going into your mouth or they can just print a surgical guide and put in the, the drill sleeves and go straight in and, uh, and perform this procedure which is now going to be a lot less harmful and a lot less uh, healing time because it's more accurate. Uh, we actually, a lot of our earliest customers were uh, dentists and they were using it to make suck downs which is um, essentially what an Invisalign tray is. They would print uh, a model of the teeth and then they would vacuum form surgical guides over the, the model and they would use that. But this is actually a bit more of a refined process because we are uh, collaborating with a lot of um, uh, service providers in the dental industry that make uh, intraoral scanners and make curing ovens and make uh, metrology devices that we can use to validate the prints. This is the first uh, class one FDA certified uh, material for the desktop. So prior to this, there was no way you could get a, uh, a dental surgical guide material without buying an expensive industrial commercial machine. So this is the first one that's accessible to smaller business owners like dental offices. We had noticed with our flexible resin that it would tear after a lot of uh, uh, manipulation. So we reformulated the, the flexible resin so it's a lot more like nylon now uh, and it's a lot, a lot more durable and longer lasting. And it actually uh, it has a new matte finish that is um, a lot more aesthetically pleasing, actually. So it looks really good. It looks kind of like a nylon uh, material that you would see uh, in, you know, uh, shoes or something like that. Um, and we've actually reformulated our our couple of our standard resins too to have better material properties, so that they uh, have a better finish and they look a lot better. Uh, but mainly, it was just a reformulation for aesthetic purposes for those. I think that the the dental SG resin is going to be a huge breakthrough for us because. Um, we had a few dentists who were kind of, uh, you know, knocking at the gate saying we need this because we could we could unlock a huge new market for ourselves and for Form Labs. Um, so I think that by launching the Dental SG, we're getting a ton of interest from dentists, and we're going to be doing a lot of uh, dental industry trade shows later on this year, uh, and, and really kind of explore that market because I think that there's a huge untapped market, much like there was for us when we launched our Castable resin two years ago. We had a few jewelers who were like. This machine is great if only you had a burnout casting material. And then we came out with a burnout casting material and we had a, hundreds of new customers like overnight that we didn't have before. So I think the Dental SG is gonna be a lot like that for us. We've always kind of been looking for a, uh, a 3D model marketplace, um, but obviously that takes a lot of uh, resources to develop internally. And we've been focused mostly on hardware and materials, so we've never really had the the extra capacity to develop something like Pinshape. Um, Pinshape announced that they were going to be folding, and it was a unique opportunity for us to uh, kind of step in and be uh, angels and take them over. Uh, so we're retaining a lot of, of their people, and um, all of their customers and users get to still have their models up on Pinshape, which is a great marketplace for, for people who um, generate models uh, for sale on Pinshape, and it allows us to tap into that marketplace. And hopefully, the collaboration uh, will be pretty, pretty amazing going forward.